Hi there. I'm Chimo Yebila. I'm part of the eldership at City Hill Hillcrest. And it's a privilege to bring you the daily devotion for today. And I'll be speaking on our words shape our lives. Our text is from James 3 verse 5. It says, likewise, the tongue is a small part of the body, but it makes great boasts. When I first became a follower of Jesus, I had a lot of trouble with my tongue, with my words. Then I realized that the Bible had a lot to say about the right use of our tongue. So I started to seek God about him helping me to tame my tongue. I want to believe that over this many years, I have grown a lot. But I can say this, I am still learning. Uh, you see, this passage contains that the tongue has power and it can determine the direction of our lives. Uh, you think about it, every single war that has been fought on this planet has come because of what people said or didn't say. Every single marriage or home, family that you have today has come because somebody said, I do. And any healthy psychological person today will tell you that he's where he is today because somebody or some people spoke some living words or words of equipping into their lives. In verse 3 and 4 before this verse 5, James compares the, the tongue to two things, the beats on a horse's mouth and the router on a large ship. What is similar between the three things, the, the beat on the mouth of a horse, uh, the router on a large ship, and our tongue is that how, just how small they are, yet the massive impact they have on the entire entity. They can, we can turn the horse in any direction we want to go just by using the beat in, the, in his mouth. And we can take that huge ship and make it go. The captain can make it go in any direction just by using the router. Our life is large and sometimes complex, but with the tongue, we can make it go in any direction. Just think about that. We can use our tongue to speak words that would bring praise to God, or we can use it to destroy others, and we can use it to destroy ourselves, definitely. It, it's like the captain of the ship. He's not careless about how he uses the router of the ship. He's very deliberate about using it to steer that ship to the place he wants it to go. Think the same thing about the, the, the rider on the horse. The way that he uses that bit in the mouth of the horse is that he uses it to determine that the horse goes in the direction he wants the horse to go to. That's the same way we should be using our tongue and our mouth. Are we using our tongue in a way that will make us go in the place we want to go? We are going through a period that is straining to our emotions with this pandemic and the long term lockdown. And it tends to affect the way we speak. Instead of joining others to speak fear, hate and confusion. We can choose to speak to lift Jesus up. We can decide to speak encouragement, peace, faith, love. We can use our tongue to steer our life, our family and our nation in the direction that God wants it to go. Good morning.